Bobzine.com. Thanks for joining me for another video beer review. This time we've got another bottle of beer from Siren in Fitchamstead, Berkshire. It's a bottle of their barrel aged, even more Jesus, number eight. This one is aged in uh, hazelnut liqueur barrels, 11.4% ABV, brewed in collaboration with Evil Twin. So even since um, Ryan moved on from Siren, They've kept up the brewing of this absolutely amazing beer. Sounds amazing. Hazelnut liqueur barrels. I don't even know what that is, but it sounds amazing. I love a big sweet stout. This is what I'm completely expecting from this. Oh, pouring out nice and thick as well. This, mm, yeah, I don't know if there is any sediment in that. So, let's have a pour then. Let's pop it in. Don't want to waste a drop. Try not to get a preview of the aroma because I'm sure it's a monster. Beer in the glass, I go, yeah. Very black, eight, um, heading, heading towards kind of like a dark brown. The head, whoo, 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 look at that, it's dark. That's a seriously dark brown head. As far as the aroma goes, now. Boozy. Yeah, you're getting all of that, you're getting that look here. Big time, that's really prevalent. It reminds me in a lot of ways that the amount of um, Grand Mania you pick up from Magic Ross Bearded Lady. That's the first thing. It's kind of, I, I, I was sampling some uh, bourbon this afternoon uh, and to get past, you know, get back past that, the, the kind of the, like ethanol of alcohol, um, then you start picking up the other things and I think this is what's happening with this. Cause it's boozy, boozy, boozy. Then it's nutty. The kind of, yeah. Bit of chocolate. But earthy, nutty. As it gets past that, the barrel, the liqueur, does have a kind of like a, a an orange liqueur edge to it, oddly. Leathery. Bacon chocolate, but it's getting past that kind of the, those alcoholic phenols. And when you do, it's nice. Let's dive in. Cheers. Oh, so the mouthfeel on that is delightful. Oh, oh, oh. Well, I've got another bottle of this coming. But big thanks to my buddy Adam over at Adam's Craft Beer Channel. Check out his channel if you haven't, because Adam picked me up a bottle of this when he bought some stuff online. I said I thought I was going to miss out. I've located some more. I'm glad I have because I think this will improve with a bit of time when that kind of alcohol drops. I think it'll be really nice. But right now, yeah, big intense hazelnut. Obviously, it is hazelnut liqueur. You do have that kind of slightly boozy edge to it. The vanilla you get from an, um, an oak barrel. Full bodied though. Big molasses. Burnt treacle. That lingers as well. The bitterness of, of kind of like burnt sugar. Chocolate, hint of almond. Oh, yeah, big molasses and, and nuts. As much as the, I don't think the body's huge. Top end of meat actually, but I'm end of full. But it's that mouthfeel. Mouthfeel's full and creamy. Mm. Mm. It's beautiful. Probably one of the better versions of even my juice I've had. First one was probably the best. Just a straight up one. This is probably one of the best I've had since, but this is absolutely, yeah. Nose is kind of dropping down a bit more now. I'm getting a bit more coconut. Yeah, that kind of alcohol is dropping out. But I reckon in a couple of years, oh, oh that's gonna be absolutely flawless. Lovely stuff. Well, excuse me, well carbonated as well for this. Pretty safe, do you think? Um, so that is a bottle of 
Siren's collaboration with Evil, Evil Twin. And it is a barrel aged version of Eve Margie's number eight. Um, aged in hazelnut liqueur barrels. An absolutely stellar Imperial Stout. Love it. I'm Rob from Hobbsy.com. See you next time. Cheers.